so it is 9.33. I just made it to the convention center, which is in the Sheraton Hotel. I'm gonna go ahead and try and check in and find my booth real quick. We just checked in. At first I had like a slight issue. They had given me like a 6x4 when I needed an 8x8. But luckily they were very nice and accommodating. They moved my table a little bit so I wouldn't have to lose my spot. And yeah, now I have an 8x8. I'm going back to the car to go on my stuff. Okay, we got our stuff and we're headed to the room now. Setting up was fairly easy. Um, I would say it took us about two hours to set up the shop. I basically just put two tables into like an L shape for this con, trying out a new booth layout since I got a corner booth. Right, it's 11.40, we just finished setting up, so let me show you guys what it looks like. All right, so we had to make some arrangements, but we got a corner booth. So this is the pink table, had the tote bags up top, I had the tumbler cups in the middle, keychains and glass cups here. And then we kind of had to like rearrange things a little bit, but this is the blue table on the side. Isn't it pretty together? <laughs> yeah, these are all the plushies up here, keychains in the middle, and mini plushies down here. And that's it. Entrance. Okay, thank you. This is the entrance, and you can see my shop right here. So I'm pretty happy with it. This is the entire venue. It's very pretty. Over here, you can see my mom's just fixing my hair. Sometimes during convention setups, it gets so crazy and busy, my hair just gets all over the place. <laughs> Anyways, this is 12 o'clock when the door is open to the attendees, and it was so cool to be at the front entrance. I got a really good spot, and it was awesome to see everyone just coming in, seeing all the different cosplays and customers. Usually, the artist alley is like at the back of the con, and they'll put vendors up front first, but this con was pretty interesting. They kind of like mix the artists and vendors which actually worked to my advantage so i'm very grateful for the host for putting me in a really nice spot um it was honestly just pure luck but it really helped me sales wise on friday Friday morning was actually such a rush. I really did not expect so many people to arrive on a weekday because usually weekdays are kind of slow for me, but I'm so grateful. Friday definitely exceeded my expectations at the show. Hey, this is the Kawaii Unlimited. She's such a sweet artist, very talented. You guys gotta follow them here. Yeah, she sells like all these like anime peeker stickers. Aren't they fun? And then look at these hats. <laughs> I love this one. So cute. And she also has some pouches left. She's been super popular. You guys need to check her things out. Look at these girl power stickers. Adorable. This <laughs> Whitney gave me this super cute bean puppy cat sticker. Oh, look at her packaging. So nice and professional. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Kit Kats. They're like one of my favorites. I love my booth neighbor. She sells such cute stuff. 
I have my eye on the Lulu Sweet Kawaii stuff. I love her shop. And then my mom is currently shopping like all of her body soaps and stuff. <laughs> okay, so it is 324. So far, so good, actually. I'm pretty happy. I had low expectations for Friday, but because we're right at the entrance, we got a really good spot, and it's been pretty consistent traffic. So I'm pretty happy with the result. The room seemed very small, so it kind of like concerned me a little bit, especially when I got like a 6x4 when I first got here. But luckily, they were able to accommodate me and give me the 8x8 that I needed, and things have been going good. Um, because I got an 8x8 instead of the 10x10 which I applied for. I had to change my booth a little bit. So we made it like a corner basically behind me and so far I really like the format. I think I might start doing this a little more often. Yes, so my friend Lena from the Hawaii shop wanted you to have that. <laughs> yeah. I cannot focus. Look at this. Oh, I'm shaking. I've been wanting one of these for so long. Thank you so much, Lena. Oh gosh, if you guys don't know, I've been following Lulu's Sweet Quiet World. I'm pretty sure I messed it up. I've been following them since I've been in high school and they've been such a huge inspiration to me to make like kawaii merch. Look at these little heart button details. And it's Ida bag. I can put little pins here. It's like a miniature wallet. Oh my gosh. And it's a keychain. This is my favorite thing ever. Thank you so much. Guys, I cannot stop. Her branding is so beautiful. Look at her teddy bears. These are all her original designs. Aren't they so cute? Her boot just gives me so much serotonin. I love it. Look at these mouse pads. So cute. Oh my gosh, my mom got me the blanket. Ah, I love it so much. <laughs> yeah, look, she has some plushies. I love all of her little characters. They're so professional and sweet. She's got these cute lights. And then this is her stationery. Oh, I love her stuff so much. She has these kawaii planners. And this is her new stickers. Very cute. Yes, please go follow her shop. Yes, please go follow her here at Fuji B. Love her stuff. <laughs> okay, 7.30. This is pretty much the result for day one. It went pretty well. Um, I sold out of my Kirby tote bag, which used to be over here. And then this is the remaining of the cups. It looks pretty sparse. Um, I actually sold out of all of my new designs. I had a... A uh, Halloween cat, a fall one, and a BTS one, and they all sold out, which is awesome. And then my cups are looking pretty sparse here. I need to fill them out, but I sold a lot more than I thought I would. The keychains did really well. I've been restocking them slowly. And on this side, we actually sold out of the meringues, which I'm so happy about. <laughs> See, sold out. And then these are the plushies. The Pokemons are as popular as always. And people really like the Calcifer and the Soot Sprite today. And then my mom also brought some Halloween plushies since it's getting near that time of year. <laughs> but yeah, it's been surprisingly good for Friday. Usually I have pretty low expectations for um, weekdays, but it went really well. I'm very happy. <laughs> we're all wrapped up and we're gonna go ahead and get some dinner and head back to the hotel. All right, it's eight o'clock. We just finished. And we're gonna go and get some dinner. I'm so hungry. All right, sign 14. We just made it to the hotel center, and we're going straight to the vendor room to unwrap our shop. Back at our shop, we're gonna open. Okay, cool. For when we go back? Yeah. 
of a cargo van yesterday and I didn't want to go and get them. <laughs> Thank you. I think we have about 40 minutes until the convention center opens. I'm really excited. They seem to have a line outside. I'm going to go ahead and fix up the shop a little bit and add any commission touches. Okay, so it is 9.56, we just finished setting up. We have about four more minutes until the con starts. I'm excited. Saturday went really well. It actually got so busy. I didn't really record that many clips, but this is the very start of the con when they first opened the doors to the attendees. And it was such a great rush. I had so much fun meeting all you guys and selling my cups. I honestly am so amazed at this con. This has definitely been one of my better shows in a long time, actually. Lunch for today. It's the front entrance. So it's starting to slow down a little bit. We have about two more hours to the convention end, and I got to do a little bit of shopping. I'm so happy. I got this super cute package from Fuji B. Let me see. Let me show it off, you guys. So I got this. Oops. Oh no. So I got this like pop socket. I'm gonna use this for my phone. And then I got like these little crop charms. Look at this super cute case I got from Fuji B. Oh, I've been eyeing this since Fable Comic Con. I'm so happy I got one. Yay! I'm also going to Superstar. Oh, you're going? Yeah. Oh, yay! Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah, so we both have our own tables. Oh, yeah. So it's y'all, us, and her. And I think she says she's going to. Oh, I hope oh, we're going to make it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> This frame from Small Lift Co. Look how cute! It's a Totoro open. I love it. I <laughs> also got this super cute little Ida bag from um, the Kwai Snack and Lulu Sweet Kwai Shop. Cute! Oh, adorable. And lastly, I am terrible at vlogging. I need to clip this on so you guys can hear me properly. So I got this super cute like strawberry Kit Kat print from a Kofuku. She was so sweet and then she gave me a matching sticker. Isn't it adorable? I love it. Uh, this is from Jenny Studio. Look at these. One that says Bobaholic and they're holographic. This one also says Boba Holic. <laughs> this one's hilarious. <laughs> I love like the koi stuff, like the aggressive messages. I love them, so cute. We have about an hour left in the con, and this is the result for today. It did pretty good. Um, I sold out of all of my tote bags. And then it was kind of empty, so I started filling it with my mouse pads so it wouldn't look so sad. I sold out of a couple of my Ghibli keychains and Sanrio keychains. And I've been restocking this slowly throughout the day, so this is all the keychains I have left. I think in total I probably brought like maybe 40 or 50 of these, if I'm not mistaken. And then, oh my gosh, the cups did really good. I sold out of all of my glass cups, which is amazing. And then we have a couple more tumbler cups left. Um, I've been restocking them from the table and this is all I have left, which is like maybe 10 cups in total. Yes, you're welcome to touch anything. Oh, you're good. I didn't know if you were like recording. <laughs> you're good, you're good. And then this is the result of the blue table here. Yeah, we sold out uh, the cinnamon roll hats. The little plushies have been doing pretty good and we sold out of our Kirby plush. Yeah, I'm really happy and we sold out of our meringue. Oh, it's been really good today. All packed up and we'll be back for the last day. <laughs> it's 8 o'clock. We finished packing and we're going to go ahead and leave now. Okay, it's 901. We're here at the hotel. We're gonna go ahead and set up our ship for today.
Okay, so it is 9.40. I pretty much finished setting up, besides turning on the lights, and then the show's supposed to start at 10. Now, Sunday is supposed to be pretty slow. It's going to be only from 10 o'clock to 4 o'clock, which I appreciate because I got a long drive home. So far, I've been so happy with this all. I sold out of so many things. I brought like 200 cups, and now I only have 7 more left. So, my fiancé is actually going to be bringing me some more cups, so that way I don't have an empty table on Sunday. <laughs> so, I'm so thankful for him but yeah hopefully the rest of today will go well i'm super excited okay so my table is looking really empty this morning so i decided to fill it up a little bit so i hung up some of the plushies put the hats over here and then i put all the cups here and then i put the plushies on the spinners it gives me so much joy <laughs> I think they're so cute like that. And then I just scooted my stuff to the side so it looks a little less sad. <laughs> that <is so> awesome! <laughs> nice! Alright, it's 10.15. We're open for shop today. And look what I got. I met this super sweet girl. She owns Inari Shrine Cafe. Look at this super cute tote bag. Oh, she spoiled me. She gave me so many things. I want to show it off to you guys. Let me see. But first off, look at this cute tote bag. I love her art style. Ah, she gave me so many things. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's a cup. Oh, this is her. I think she said this is her and her partner. Let me see. Oh, she makes these tumbler cups. Oh my god. <laughs> so cute. This is her OC. Oh, it's like a nice green color because of the straw. These are cute. And then, let's see. I also got, thanks mom. Oh, it's a t-shirt. What? This is so cool. Oh my gosh, thank you so much, Inari. You spoiled me. Thank you, mom. I have my mom carry all my things. Look, it's a little t-shirt with her logo on it. How cute! I'm loving the color of I know, guy. I like this. And then, oh, this is my favorite. Look, it's a zipper pouch with their little mascot. It's so cute. Ah! And then the mini one to match stock. This is so adorable. Look at these. Oh, I'm gonna use these for my stationery. It help me keep organized. Ah, thank you so much, Inari. These are so cute. Selling on Sunday was a little bit slower, but that's pretty much always expected. Saturdays are almost always the most popular day, and then Sundays there's less attendees, a lot of returning customers, but I personally enjoy it because then I can take my time having more intimate conversations with you guys, getting to know my customers, and connecting with other artists, which is always very fun for me, so I really enjoy selling on Sundays. So I was so surprised to meet so many of you guys at this show. It's really cool to put like a face to the username. I love meeting my followers and subscribers. You guys make me feel so special and welcome at every show. And I just want to say I appreciate you guys so much for coming to visit me and supporting. It really does warm my heart. Gosh, you guys, I sold out of all my cups. I only have one last Lucky Cat cup left. That's it. Wow. Okay, so it's 118 Sunday, and I just sold out of all my tumbler cups. Oh my gosh. I actually sold out of all my glass cups too, and my fiance brought me some more cups to restock last night, so I wouldn't be too empty. Oh my gosh, this is so crazy. Being a part of this show was honestly such a blast. As you guys know from my vlogs, I usually go to like Comic Cons, so this was my very first anime convention, anime theme convention, and I do think I prefer these kind of events. I think with my art style and my theme of my shop, um, I do a lot better at anime cons, so I'm definitely looking forward to doing more of these. I was surprised, um, they actually had a food truck for the boba, which was really, really good. I wish I got the name of the vendor. If you guys know, please comment below. And then I got this super cute art from Pirates Art. 
But yeah, because it was an anime con, there was a lot of cosplayers, and it was so nice to see people knowing the references for my artwork, they knew what the characters were, and it was just such an awesome time. I really enjoyed talking about my favorite animes with you guys. Look at this cute little candles I got from Sweet Life. She was so nice. Like she got me a little bunny one. They smell so good. Thank you so much. But yes, this is Sweet Life. She makes super oh, cute candles. Look, they look like little desserts. I love them so much. She's the one that gave me the little bunny candle I showed you guys earlier. And look at her packaging. It's so beautiful. I got this plushie from my mom. It's designed by Lulu Sweet Koi Shop, and I got it from the Koi Snack. Thank you. <laughs> and right here, I was just selling by myself. I gave my mom a little break, and I guess my fiance noticed and just came in to check on me, which was so sweet. <laughs> Gosh, I don't have my mic, but my mom got me this. I already know what it is from the prints. I've been wanting it for so long. Now I can use it as a travel blanket when I go to cons. I'm so excited! Oh. Let me show you guys. It's beautiful. <laughs> I got a blanket from Fuji B. It's so cute. Thank you, Martha. Oh, this is gonna be my con blanket. I'm so excited. Thank you. I got these super cute little wing earrings from my booth neighbor, Matcha Parfait Productions. You guys should go follow them. Look at their adorable matcha pin. Ah, I love their mascot. Super cute. All right, so I'm here at the Kawaii Snack. She's been the best table neighbor ever. Look at her stuff. It's so cute, excuse me. Yeah, she does a lot of like other promotions for artists. She's got Lulu's Sweet Kawaii Shop. Oh, and I got the Ida bag and the Ducky Pushy. I love them so much. Over here, she sells like candles and keychains. Excuse me, sorry. Oh, it's been such a joy being with her. Look at her cute stuff, it's so beautiful. All these like kawaii plushies, and then she has all of these like candles and body scents. I know her most popular one was her peach one. I wonder if I could find it. Look at these, they are so cute. <laughs> She's got cotton candy. Oh, I love it all. She also has like all these kawaii bags. I love her display so much. Look at these boba bags. So cute. <laughs> all right, it's 8.40. I just walked around the artist alley, said hey to some friends. Ooh, my hair looks crazy. All right, and we're gonna go ahead and start cleaning up first. This is summarized, this is all I have left. Um, I sold out of all of my tote bags, all of my mouse pad designs besides the bunny one. This is what's left over in my keychains. And I can't believe I sold out of all my tumblers. It's been really good. And I actually sold out of all my glass cups. Um, I put some of my fiance's cups here <laughs> so my shop wouldn't look too empty. And this is what's left over. So we sold about 20 tumbler cup designs and 10 glass cup designs. It's been amazing. Oh, and my light went out. Tell me to go home. <laughs> And then over here, the plushy table did pretty good. Um, we did bring a stock of about 10 of each, so thankfully we'll have some left over for Superstar Anime next week. But yeah, I had one last Hello Kitty keychain left. The ducky keychain, I mean the ducky plushies did really well, and the whales. We sold the Coraline, sold out of the meringue plush. And yeah, the Sanrio plushies are really popular. They did so well. Pretty much done cleaning up, and we're gonna go ahead and pack everything in the car. We're done. All right, it's 4:45. I just finished, and we're gonna go ahead and head home. So this is the hallway. They had like the celebrities and stuff, and then this was the vendor room, and then that first black table was my spot. Okay, and that's a wrap for Queen City Anime Con. Guys, I had so much fun at this show. This has definitely become one of my favorite events to vend at. The hosts were so kind and they treated me really well. And I'm so grateful to meet each and every one of you. I had so much fun. If you made it to the end, comment below a kitty or cat emoji. I love to know the special awesome people who watch the entire video. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you guys enjoy the next one. I'll see you guys later. Bye!